Good morning. It is 6.35 a.m. on Thursday, April 7th, 2016. I'm Christiana Ellis, and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, I've been trying to eat a more balanced diet. So, last night, uh, I had a bunch of vegetables from a crudite platter, like carrots, uh, and celery, and broccoli, and cherry tomatoes. And uh, then I balanced it out by eating half of a lemon cream cake. True story. That's how that works, right? Don't worry, it's uh, one of those round, circular, bunt cake type cakes. This is not like a big sheet cake. Just want you to know that I'm not some kind of a cake monster. See, would a cake monster be a monster made of cake or a monster that likes cake? Because I feel like in this context, cake monster makes me think more like it would be a monster made of cake. But think about Cookie Monster. He's not made of cookies. Except in the more general sense of you are what you eat. Hmm. You are what you eat in the context of Cookie Monster suddenly becomes alarming. You know, if if we are what we eat, and we eat food, that would make us food, and then we eat more food, does that make us cannibals? Thank you, everybody. Tip your waitresses. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I really don't have uh, any sort of a plan of what to talk about today. I have had mostly the balanced diet joke. The rest of that was just riffing, just riffing, you see. <laughs> uh, it's, I noticed yesterday uh, that... The I'm getting close to number 100 in terms of installments of my cereal. And I also noticed that it is getting close to my birthday. That being tomorrow. Tomorrow is my birthday. I'm not saying that to get a wave of happy birthdays in my feed. I'm sure Facebook will already take care of that for me. Thank you in advance to all those people who will see my Facebook announcement birthday thing and say happy birthday and I am genuinely thankful I'm not remotely being sarcastic I do however find it amusing that that's how it works but in any case uh, the connection between those two things mostly adds up to my disappointment that my birthday isn't the same day that would be 100 for the cereal but given that I just started the cereal on January 1st and uh, haven't missed a day since then, I guess what that really amounts to is disappointment that my birthday is not on the 100th day of the year. Um, so that seems like not a, not a great thing to be disappointed by. Just seems kind of arbitrary anyway. But there was, a, there was a moment where I thought, oh my gosh, is it going to line up just right? And then I did the math and was like, oh. And of course, you know, if it wasn't a leap year, it would be, you know, even, even further off. It would be 98 instead of 99. But whatever. You can't get too upset about these things, people. You know, sometimes in life, your birthday is on the 98th day of the year or the 99th instead of the 100th. And you just have to be able to find some way to carry on with your life. Perhaps the other half of that lemon cream cake will help. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I ate the other half already. Uh... <laughs> Boy, I just, I'm so jokey this morning. I'm not sure where that's coming from. 
No, I don't know. Maybe it's just a busy week. Um, but uh, look at that. I'm already at five minutes. So I could keep talking. But why? I'll just talk to you tomorrow for five more minutes.